the Hawker Typhoon. The Hawker Typhoon was a British ground attack aircraft that was really meant to be a high altitude interceptor. The Hawker Typhoon was also, funnily enough, really, really bad at high altitude, so it's, it's really weird. Design and development. Even before the Hurricane's production began in March 1937, Sir Sidney Cam had embarked designing its successor. Two primarily, des two primarily designs were similar in the large in the Hurricanes. These became later known as the N and the R from the initial engine manufacturers because they were designed for the newly used newly developed Napier Saber and Rolls Royce Vulture, respectfully. Both engines were used 24 cylinders and were designed for over 2,000 horsepower. The difference between the two was primarily of the, the cylinders, the H-block in the Saber and the X-block in the Vulture. Hawker submitted these Primarily designs in June, July 1937, but but were advised to wait until a formal specification for a new fighter was issued. Specifications equipped with an Napier Saber C H24 liquid cool sleep valve piston engine. 510 miles clean and 690 miles with two 45 gallon fuel tanks. In 1938, Hawker received its specification from the Air Ministry specification F. 18 37 for a fighter which would be able to achieve 400 miles per hour at 1500 feet a specified British engine with a two-speed supercharger an armament of 12 303 caliber Browning machine guns with 500 rounds per gun with the provisions for alternative combinations of weaponry Cam and his design team started development and design and constructed of these prototypes. Those prototypes were originally named the Hawker Tornado. Napier Saber 3C Engine Startup
Tempest. The Hawker Tempest was basically unchanged except for a new De Havilland propeller, a higher top speed, and a bomb load of a couple more of 100 pounds. It was also used to intercept V-1 flying bombs and was famously used for wing tipping where the V-1 would come up right or the the tornado, the typhoon would come up right to the wing of the V-1 pull up and flip out of control Thank you. 